In this video, I will show you how to clone your voice in a Filmora, as well as to translate it to a different language. So let's dive in. So the first step is to create a title, and the title simply says, making a video seems easy, but it is not. Actually, it takes a lot of effort. So with this title, you want to right click and click on text to speech, and you can actually clone your voice. Now, I've already cloned mine once, but I'm going to show you how to do it. So right now, you can go to this plus button to start cloning your voice. Click on that, and Filmora will ask you to record something on screen, right? You need to have your microphone ready. So I'm just going to change my name to JW number two. Uh, my microphone will be my microphone right now. And this is a short passage that I'm going to read. So between 20 seconds to one minute. One day, a monkey rides his bike near the river. This time he sees a lion under a tree. The lion runs at him. He is afraid and falls into the river. He can't swim. He shouts. The rabbit hears him. Right? I'm just going to stop it now. You can play to hear whether you are happy with your recording. Perhaps your microphone isn't working or there's too much background noise. So uh, you can record again if you want to. So I'm just going to create new. And Filmora is going to upload your, video, your voice and start uh, cloning your voice and it just takes a few moments to do it. Now I have my voice here and let's take a listen to it. Now I find that my voice doesn't sound uh, really that much like me. I am not quite sure whether it's because I read too fast or maybe my microphone isn't sensitive enough to catch the nuances of my voice. Let me know what do you think if you have been watching my videos, you kind of know how I sound. Now there are other voices that are built in, for example, uh, Nancy, Lily, and uh, if you click on this uh, button here, it plays back a sample of the sound. So I'm just going to select my own voice, this one here, and click create now. Filmora will upload a text and create it, and it is done. Okay, so close this and cl click on OK. So you go your, uh, to your project folder and now you have this uh, audio and if you drag it down onto a timeline, you can actually listen to this. Making a video seems easy but it is not. Actually, it takes a lot of effort. Alright, I read this a little bit fast so uh, perhaps I could just slow down the speed and we can slow down by speed by uh, clicking on the speed to adjust the media. Okay. So let's change it to uniform speed and let's just slow it down a little bit. Okay, let's take a listen to it again. The video seems easy, but it is not. Actually, it takes a lot of effort. Okay, so that is the uh, AI generated uh, voice. Now, if you want to translate this to another language, what you can do is to select the text, right click again, go to AI translation now and translate it to another language. Now, so the source language in this case is US, and these are the languages available. Now, I am not familiar with the other language, but Indonesian is the closest to the one that I know. So, uh, I'm just going to click Create, and what Filmora will do now is to translate it to Indonesian. Let's close it. It is done. Click on OK, and now this is the uh, translated subtitle. I'm going to drag it on to the timeline here. I have the Indonesian version uh, translation. Membuat video nampaknya mudah tetapi ternyata tidak. Sebenarnya itu membutuhkan banyak user. Now, I am not quite sure about this word here. So, let's just uh, try it out and see. Okay, so it's translated as need. Alright, so needs a lot of effort. So I am not quite sure about this, so if it's any ping long, please, I hope it is not a four letter word of some sort. Alright, so next, I'm going to translate this to the Indonesian voice. So now I'm going to right click again, now go to uh, text to speech. Now I'm still going to choose uh, my voice and I'm just going to just click create. So now Filmora will take my voice and read out the Indonesian text. Click on close, click on OK again. And now, this is the translated uh, sound. Let's drag this down to this uh, channel. I'm going to mute this. Let's take a listen. Let's see if it's alright. Membuat video tampaknya mudah, tetapi ternyata tidak. Sebenarnya, 
itu membutuhkan banyak usaha. Not too bad, not too bad. You can also create voice cloning at the Filmora startup screen. Click on AI text to video. In this box, type in your text. And if you click clone voice, uh, Filmora will tell you to record your voice if you have never recorded your voice at the beginning. This is creating your voice. Now, if you want to create now, you can select the voice, your, your recorded voice here, or any of the voices that's available and create now. And Filmora will actually create that video. So in this case, Filmora will create that video with the visuals as well as the captions, as well as the created voice and also a background music as well. So anyway, this is how you use Filmora to clone your voice. Uh, give it a try and see whether it, your voice sounds alike and let me know in the comments how it went for you. So if you enjoyed this video, remember to like, share and subscribe this and uh, check out what's on the screen right now for the next Filmora tip.